All right, so here we go at the Wells Fargo Championship at Quail Hollow. <clears throat> our, we have four rounds. We're gonna start off with round one. Our sponsor objective is to get five consecutive birdies or better. So we got four chances to do this. So once again, guys, thank you so much for all the watching, all the subscribes, all the likes. If there's anything that you guys want to see, me play in the morning coffee round as I warm up. If there's any courses you want me to play, I'll do those live in the morning. We got our screenshot for this tournament. This is career mode, playing in pro with the putt meter. Thank you very little. Dog leg to the right, bunkers down the left hand side. Only reserved for the long hitters, but the second shot to a very narrow green that sits down below the player. It's a very difficult opening hole. You make four here, you're pretty happy. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. All right. I just wanted to wait until they uh, finished talking over there. But So I, this is the first time I'm playing this course. I love the perspective lines here <clears throat> with the... Um, with the people watching and just this galley like tree lining fairway um is beautiful and um yeah we got a nine mile an hour wind we're gonna hit that as straight as can be and we're slicing that with the dog leg and with the wind is it enough to hold on to the fairway no we're in the first cut <clears throat> So, we got some elevation change and some wind. And that's probably too much. All right, we got our par. So far, very impressed with the first hole. Leaders are at minus three. We got another tight fairway here. With the, I love the trees lining the fairway. It feels like the course is hugging me. John, you're down there. What's happening? Down here on the seventh hole, fellas. This is Jim Fury sitting up in the next shot. Sadly, in the sand, got a chance to make up for you. Taking aim from about 170 yards. Wind's blowing right to left here. They're going to go ahead and ride the one in here. Looks to be going with the fire line. Oh, this would be handy if we bounce right. All right, we got a chip in birdie. Let's see if we can get that consecutive birdie streak going. So it seems like we're going to have to play well here. Um, tight fairways, tree lining, and a lot of elevation change. Um, so I'm loving the course. I'm loving the look of the course. I was actually hoping to hit that a little bit slow and hit it into the wind, but all right. So it looks like the rough is going to grab the club here a little bit. <clears throat> Not sure if that's even going to be enough to get up there. <clears throat> the well placement of the sand traps got me. Got a 
shots. Alright, we saved our part. It's currently one under for the tournament. Team off here at the point. Play with the five iron here. If I judge the wind right. Uphill, we're gonna go with the six iron. Looks to be going with the six iron. And we play it out to the left for the wind to carry it over. And here we are with the third shot. Three strokes off the lead. Probably played a little bit too far out, but. We <clears throat> hooked that swing over, so. Alright. Dead center of the hole. So we're going to choke a little bit down on the three wood. See if we can ride the wind in there. We're also going to add some loft and some backspin. What you need. There you go. And that's looking good. We got trees on the left, water on the right. Spin on this. We got an opportunity to get this close. Seems to have chosen the three. Get the ball to sit. Well, that's good boy golf right there. All right, we're on in two. Sunk our birdie putt. We're three under, three off the lead. Double tree lining fairway. I 
And we got a kick into the heavier rough. So I'm loving this course so far. Oh, we hit that so slow. Have some tree trouble on your second shot. Well, this should be unpredictable. Let's have a look at Bryce and Deshambo. All right, John. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna be in a little bit of trouble here again. We're just gonna go ahead and hit the driver through this. I don't think there's any big branches there. Where will this one end up? And if we can get a little help from the cart path. Come on, get better than that. It's always a good view playing from an elevated position to the green. Opting for the hybrid, I think. I think that was a good shot. Oh, we rolled right into the same trap. All right, so we're gonna have to hit a decent lob wedge sand shot. To set up our par. Alright, we're going to try to hit just a little bit of a fast shot here, see if we can kind of hook around this dog leg left. Very subtly. I think the pitching wedge should be fine with the wind. Great read. That will take him to five under. Coming off 
for Booty. They can plan themselves a chance to keep it rolling. Beautiful swing there. I think that's going to stay in the fairway. <clears throat> Second shot here on the toy. Going with the six iron here. Hoping for a bounce here, preferably to the left. Hard to get that one close. <clears throat> it's better to say that that approach didn't hit the mark. Oh, as we can see there, the wind definitely affecting that shot. Ooh, that almost went down. He has this putt to save his par. Alright, not a give me by any means. to fight the wind. Second shot. This one's looking good off the tee. That should find the short stuff. Time to recap Rice and DeShambo's effort from just a little while ago. Oh, check this out. Showing us how it's done from the sand. And from the bucket here. Play a little bit of a draw <clears throat> to go with the wind. Now four under par. Currently tied for second. All right, that's a fun shot. Hole at Quail Hollow Club, you're reminded that you're entering the Green Mile. 
again, only the long players can carry the bunker down the right-hand side. Hit it out to the left, avoid that bunker, and give yourself the best opportunity to find the green and two. All right, we didn't avoid the bunker. But, man, <clears throat> it almost seems like you're coming out of the forest on this hole. Where, like, every other hole seemed to be um, lined with trees. Okay, let's get back to the action. This one is a little more open, but we got a lot of water. And dangerously, we're going to have to play this to the left because of the wind and the lie. Looks like it's sloping where it's going to jump out to the right a little bit. We're probably going to end up in that sand trap, I'm guessing. Yeah, that jumped out a lot. <clears throat> Alright, nice sand trap. Tap in par. We're going to move on to the 17th hole. Time to step up and make the best swing of the day on this challenging par 317th. Find the center of the green and you're a happy player. With the All right, I hit what I wanted to hit. We put some backspin on it. Well played. Well, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. Tap in par. We didn't even come close to being able to try to do the five consecutive birdies. Yes, water going all the way down the left hand side of the fairway. That bunker on the right has crippled many a player. Find the fairway and give yourself an opportunity to find the green and two. This shot from about 190 yards out. The wind is blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride the wind back to this pit. Looks to be going with a It's a good pit. line. Well, this one's right at the pit. <laughs> yeah, nicely played. John, have you got a read on this one? Well, from, the, from my viewpoint, at least, looks around 29 feet. I'm going to miss that on the low side. Dropped our birdie to start off with a five under. We hold second place alone. <clears throat> All right, so thanks for tuning in. Um, I'll take a short break and then we'll start off on round two. All right, here we are. We took a short break. Um, we're at the Wells Fargo Championship for round two. I'm going to put this right at the end of round one and make one video. Um, thank you again, guys, for all the watches, all the subscriptions, all the views. It's much, 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 it's much appreciated. So for our sponsor, we're going to finish in the top um, three and two events, that's for sure. We already did one. The five consecutive birdies are better in a round at the Wells Fargo Championship. Apparently last round we did three. Didn't even think we did that, but... Um, yeah, we'll give it a go. Uh, it's a tough course. I really like the layout. <clears throat> We're going to start this off at round two. I got my cup of tea.
the season long race for the FedEx Cup. Yeah, I really like how the trees line the fairways. It's not until the back nine that the second shot opens up to something. And there's a lot of elevation change, so it's a challenging course. All right, so we're five under. We're tied for the lead. Let's see what happens here on the second hole. That reminded me of the big easy, silky smooth. I'm hugging the turn on this dog leg. We should be able to make a birdie here. <clears throat> it's not a give me by any means. Uh, we never had the right line. Not sure if that's going to hold the fairway. For a chip shot. Oh. Gave that a go. Nicely done. 
Let's have a look at Kevin Kisner from just a short time ago. Third shot now. <laughs> Let's get back to it, shall we? Lining up the birdie putt here. All right, that's a good line. I'm not sure if it's going to be too much or not. <clears throat> all right, the backspin, the loft, that all helped, and hitting it on a little bit of an upslope helped. fairway we got trees on the left water on the right <clears throat> we hit it a touch slow I'm trying to see if the fairway slopes that way or not I think it does but we're safe <clears throat> time to be aggressive we're gonna hit that three wood, add a little loft, add a little backspin, see if we can hold the green. With the three wood here. And we're gonna go right at the green. Well, this person displays the power game in pure fashion there. Always like the aggressive play, going for it too and get rewarded for it. Putt's looking good. <clears throat> Alright, so we got the eagle. <clears throat> so I'm wondering with the sponsor deal, the five consecutive birdies, I wonder if you basically have to get five birdies in a row or can you get five like birdie birdie type of things um we'll see after this round swing
Well, I like the look of the line here. This should find a fair way. Time for the second shot at the 10. All right, we're going to be aggressive. So I think we got four in a row. Yeah, I'm not sure if that eagle counts. But we're going to give this a go. I didn't like it. So there goes our streak. We've made chip shots before. Haven't made one in a while. Get a good kick. I'll take that. Missed that. Now, 
final short tap after that hole. All right, getting into our final stretch. Time to tee off here at the 14. You attack it and try to increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? This one might roll into the rough. Trepid on caution Porter, Joel standing by. Well, down here on the 14th, this is Billy Porsche's next shot. Oh, that one just missed the hole. Second shot here on the 14th hole. I actually tried hooking that a little bit, but we're okay. And this effort by Justin Thomas just a short while ago. He's a sharp shooter from short range, isn't he? Let's return to live play now. Time now to play the second shot on the 15th hole. All right, the green's sloping back to front, so we're gonna hit the lob or yeah, the lob wedge for a flop shot at 90%. Pull a lot of backspin. <clears throat> See if we can throw this be behind the pin and then spin it backwards. Okay, or that. Here at the 17th. The 
best way to play this whole loop is to bail your tee shot out to the right in the swale, chip it on, two foot, make your bogey, and be happy about that score. <laughs> All right, man, that's a lot of commentary. <laughs> but we're going to be a little aggressive and go for it. <clears throat> they had me second guessing it. <laughs> no bailout area. All right, we hit it long, but that was good. The commentary there gave me a laugh. See if we can just get this close. So we got a bogey, but we had a few shots to give back. It's the way to start that hole. All right, we're going to put some top spin on that. Looks to be going with the fire line. <clears throat> See if we can get it to roll up that hill. Alright, so we got round two in the books. And we shot a minus eight today. So minus 13 total for the round. We put some distance. We got a three shot lead going into moving day. All right, so we got four out of five consecutive birdies. Um, yeah, that was close. We almost got that. But all right, I'm going to take a short break again. We're going to put these two rounds together and make one video, and then we're going to tackle round three and round four separately. So appreciate it. Much love. You guys have a great day.